Good morning everyone, it is Monday morning and we are back at it again. We've left mom and dad's house, we came up here to Newton, North Carolina and picked up some cable reels and I got them loaded up and now we are on our way to El Paso, Texas. So uh, I think I might, I used to work up here in Conover and I'm in Conover right now, pulling into the fly, or the pilot to get some fuel. Turn and left, then slide right. I might just stop and see, say hey to some of my old co-workers. So we'll see. In 300 feet, sharp left. Anyway, this is a bouncy little road. <laughs> All right, let's sharp get this thing left. started. Then you will arrive. I'm not heading for the stars, driving down the boulevard tonight. Playing cool, play on repeat. Watching people on the street as I go by And it doesn't even matter to me where I go I just feel I need to take There's my old stomping grounds Me and Ash gonna go say hey to some people Come on Ash So yeah, it'll be fun Okay Now my wheels in motion And my windows open with the wind these ants they're huge and they're 
got a big old nest. Goodness gracious. Yeah, come on. Okay, we got unloaded this morning in El Paso. <laughs> and uh, uh, now we've got an empty trailer and we got to wait till tomorrow morning to pick up the next load here in El Paso as well. So I just unhooked from the trailer and I'm gonna go explore. I think I'm gonna go find a grave of an old west gunslinger he's here in downtown el paso at a in a cemetery so i think i'm gonna go find that and then also there's a gunfight that has a famous gunfight that has taken place here in el paso as well i'm gonna go see if i can find that street that it took place on first we're gonna go get something to eat at the famous whataburger and this is not the whataburger that we have in north carolina this is the whataburgers in the west and at midwest out that way anyway they've got them here in texas so i'm gonna go find one of them and go eat at it he's he's eating me he's hungry apparently always hungry what are you doing child or dog whatever you are <laughs> what a burger I know this just looks like a normal Walmart, doesn't it? Well, this Walmart is not a normal Walmart. This at one time, two years ago in 2019, was a scene of a horrific, horrific nightmare. This man came, uh, parked 
in the parking lot here where I'm at and just started walking through the parking lot picking off people with a rifle shooting at them and then he walked inside of Walmart and kept shooting and uh, until finally somebody was able to take him down he came back out I believe police got here and surrounded Walmart a lot of people was uh, rushed out the door and went to neighboring businesses there's a mall on my right and there is a uh, Sam's Club on my left and they went and tried to hide in those stores and um, then uh, but I think he ended up uh, murdering about 26 people in this Walmart so kind of a scary thing So this street here is El Paso Street in downtown El Paso, Texas. This street's very famous. It has seen a lot of famous people. White Earp himself has walked down this street. He did not stay in the town very long because he said the town was too dangerous for him. That tells you how dangerous this town was. However, there was a court hearing going on for a couple of cowboys that had murdered some Mexican cowboys. And uh, they had a couple of friends, one of which was the former marshal of the town. And him and another guy, the landowner, where this murder took place, they were both really, really drunk and ended up picking a fight with some of the guys that were trying the, the uh, boys in the court. And, uh, well, a fight broke out, gunfight broke out. The current marshal was next door. He heard the gunshots, came over. And in the end, there was four dead guys and the marshal was the only one standing. So that's why the, the uh, famous gunfight was entitled Four Dead in Five Seconds and only took about five seconds for everything to stop. I don't know if you can hear me, the wind's really strong, but this is Snyder Electric, and I am just sitting here waiting on somebody to load me, and it's taking forever, got Nash in here, just chilling out, wishing they'd hurry up, he wants to get on the road. What's up everybody? So that's been our week for the week. I did go down to El Paso. We saw a bunch of stuff, cool stuff. I apologize for the audio on this phone. This phone's not the greatest thing for audio and my batteries keeps dying on my good camera. So I'm using the phone. But anyway, um, I went, of course, where we last picked up. I picked up at Schneider Electric in, Fort, in no, El Paso. In El Paso, Texas, picked up this thing right here really small and I had to tarp it and you see the tarps not very tight because tarps way bigger than the load itself but um, anyway I am here in Columbia South Carolina now fixing to deliver it in the morning Monday morning it's Sunday right now so I'll deliver it Monday morning and uh, then I'm gonna head home for a couple days and uh, I'm gonna release another video this week probably midweek about in detail of uh, the grave I went and saw which was John Wesley Harden he was an old uh, old west gunslinger and I'm gonna do a whole video on his story and uh, release it midweek this week and then uh, we'll be back on the road sometime midweek this week as well and uh, start making some more video and 
get it out soon for you hopefully in another week so anyway um, remember to share and like and comment and uh, we'll see you next time